Hello friends, welcome to this session. In today's session, we will see how you can run GitLab Docker image as container in Docker desktop on Windows. So you can get the GitLab Docker image details on this particular link docs.gitlab.com and you can read this particular article here it provides all the prerequisites and how to set up in docker and it says here docker for windows is not officially supported so i still tried to install this image on docker desktop on windows and to me it looks like it is working fine so i will show you the steps how to do that here if you scroll down this article you will see they talk about how to set up a gitlab home and the folders for saving data the logs and inside container where it will map to all these things and then they provide this command which we can run to start this container uh, I have already prepared this container and I will share directly the command which you should run to start GitLab in the container this is a command which will run docker run I have given name as GitLab for the container and these are docker related environment variables and the host name I have given gitlab.example.com but because you're running in docker desktop you can access using localhost it will be published on 443 for HTTPS and port 80 for HTTP restart always so that even if you reboot it will start the GitLab container and these are the volumes where the logs data and configs will be saved to your host so I've, I've given name as GitLab minus config so that all container related configs will be actually on this folder on my host and GitLab minus logs and data will be mapped to this folder inside the container and this is the image name which will be started so let's run this command now before running this command I assume that you have installed docker desktop and it is already running on your windows machine so we'll copy this command open WSL and let's run this now it will not find this image locally so it will pull the image down and it may take some time I will pause the video and come back once the image is downloaded so it's showing that container is taking too much time to start on my laptop it is a little bit slow we'll just wait for a couple of more minutes we will refresh the page again so now you can see it has started properly and it is giving you a login page now username and password so what are these username and password let's find it out so we'll go back to docs.gitlab.com article and if you scroll down further here it will tell you to run this command to get the password and also says for login the username is root so let's get the password so this is the command and we'll run it in the WSL terminal so we got the password let's copy it let's try now root and here you go we are logged into GitLab so we have successfully installed GitLab container in Docker desktop and now we can use it one more thing to mention here all the logs and data and configs which are saved on my host folder how will you find where exactly this is so for that you have to run this command docker saves everything in this particular path so go here and you can see I've already tried this and in the volumes you'll see here GitLab config GitLab data and logs so you can check everything is here otherwise in docker desktop also you can find under volumes these three folders so I hope this helps and uh, you can install your own GitLab container in Docker Desktop. Thanks for watching this video and I will see you in next session.